It was not till uh, we got our own information from a facilitator in 2004 that we learned that Al Kuwaiti was the courier for bin Laden. Al Kuwaiti, then even the name Al Kuwaiti at the time didn't mean anything to us. It, I mean, some you know, Al Kuwaiti, uh, Ahmed Al Kuwaiti is like saying Jose the Puerto Rican. Uh, <laughs> but what meant something to us, what really meant something to us, was the fact that we got validation that there was one courier who was bin Laden's a principal way of communicating with Al Qaeda Central. It meant that uh, Bin Laden had taken himself out of the day-to-day -day running of Al Qaeda. That he had decided, for whatever reason, that he was just going to run the operation long distance, recognizing, in my view, that it was going to be a lot less effective to run an operation like that from 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 far away. It also told us that uh, finding Milan was going to be a lot more difficult because he was dependent on one courier. It was not until years later that we were able to put the nom de guerre al Kuwaiti with a real name, uh, his true name, and go out and find him. So, I mean, the information that was obtained at the black sites uh, although not complete, uh, was key in my view.